You know, guys, <clears throat> who needs Collapse Chronicles anymore? I, I, I admit, uh, <laughs> my, my job uh, is in jeopardy here. Uh, who needs me when you've got the mainstream media here at the end of April of 2022? So we're about a third of the way through this year. And uh, right here in a period, what is this, in about eight, let's call it four by eight inches. Let's see, climate change could cause the mass extinction of marine life in Earth's oceans, study says. How about emperor penguins on course for extinction by end of century due to climate crisis? How about over 21% of reptile species at risk of extinction? How about climate change national security threat? But don't forget, uh, <clears throat> if you're interested and all of those stories, don't forget, you also might, lo might like the all-new Ram 1500 is stunning and cheap. Stunning and cheap. Yes, I'm sure. Okay, let's spend about five minutes on the mainstream media. Let's go right here and good old USA Today. Climate change could cause mass extinction of marine life in Earth's ocean. Study says, unless climate change is curbed, Earth's oceans could see a mass extinction of marine life unlike anything the planet has seen for millions of years, according to a new study published Thursday. Yes, quote, if carbon dioxide emissions accelerate unchecked over the next century, this would lead to extreme warming, driving extinctions in the ocean, rivaling the mass extinctions in Earth's past. Study lead author Justin Penn of Princeton University said today, the study said, that climate-driven ocean warming and oxygen depletion would be the primary reasons for the potential mass extinctions. In addition, direct human impacts such as habitat destruction, overfishing, and coastal pollution also threaten marine species. Who the hell is calling me? Probably looking for a ride to New York. Yes. Okay. Is if you did not realize this, as ocean temperatures increase and oxygen availability drops, marine life abundance plummets. Yep, yep, yep. Uh, according to the study, under business-as-usual global temperature increases, marine ecosystems planet-wide are likely to experience mass extinctions potentially rivaling the size and severity of the end Permian extinction, the Great Dying which occurred roughly 250 million years ago and led to the demise of more than two-thirds of marine animals. <clears throat> All right, from there to the emperor penguins on course for extinction by end of century. One of the world's most recognizable species, the emperor penguin, could all be could all but be extinct by the end of this century due to the climate crisis scientists have warned populations of the birds which breed on pack ice near the antarctic coast 
are at risk of, quote, rapid and dramatic decline, close quote, due to habitat loss. The World Wildlife Fund, which issued the warning, called for emperor penguins to be listed as a specially protected species, yes, to better shield them from the impacts of global warming. Mm-hmm. 80% of all known colonies of the birds are projected to be, quote, quasi-extinct, so few in number that their survival is doomed. Yep, 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 yep. Don't forget the reptiles. Over 21% of reptile species at risk of extinction. <clears throat> at least one in five reptile species are threatened with extinction, including more than half of turtles and crocodiles, according to the first major global assessment of the world's so-called cold-blooded creatures. Catastrophic declines in biodiversity across the world are increasingly seen as a threat to life on Earth and as important as the interrelated menace of climate change. Threats to other creatures have well been documented more than 40% of amphibians, 25% of mammals, and 13% of birds could also face extinction. But until now, researchers did not have a comprehensive picture of the proportion of reptiles at risk. Yep, yep, yep. Uh, it's just overwhelming the number of species that we see as being threatened, said co-author Neil Cox. Blah, blah, blah. From reptiles, I guess, just to our national security. Yes, climate change is a national security threat. Who would have thought it? The fight to slow the impacts of climate change is starting to take on new importance. Some security leaders are now sounding the alarm that our national security could be compromised by a warming planet. Yes, but uh, if you enjoyed all those stories, you will be glad to hear that the all-new Ram 1500 is stunning and cheap. Yes. Best deals on Ram pickup trucks. Uh, looks like uh, this Ram pickup truck is hauling an ATV behind it. This is people getting out in their Ram 1500 pickup trucks and enjoying it while they still can. Good thing they're not a penguin or a reptile or a fish. Anyway, enough doom and gloom for one day. I'm going to start thinking about my doom and gloomy dinner while I still can. Oh my God.